just about the lovey-dovey or having a glass of wine or chocolate or putting a face mask or just doing something or buying stuff which labeled ass that will make you feel better I think it's not for me for me self-love is all about how I feel mentally physically and emotionally and it's quite important for me to feel really good to be able to give love to my loved ones so I have some seven steps that actually helped me a lot to feel better emotionally and mentally and I hope this can help you as well step number one is logging out from your social media I personally do that once a week to just log off from all social media and try not to consume what's going on in this world. We, we already having so much going on in this world and you don't want to just consume every single thing in your brain. So I personally really like to just switch off all social media and just be present and just spend some time with my son, my husband, my dog and just enjoy doing what I want to do. It also helps a lot in how I feel mentally because I personally feel I've been consuming I won't lie but I've been consuming a lot of social media of late I've been reading news which is so disturbing and um, I've been because you're at home you you don't have anything much to do so you're so much on internet and you're trying to see others life which which is okay as far as you're not doing too much and I will highly recommend maybe once a week try and log out and just relax your mind and just feel the present and be with yourself and your loved ones and it will mentally help you a lot. nourishment now I feel in this fast-paced world we tend to forget to look after a body so try and eat good food and start your day with a nutrient packed food drink loads of water move your body in ways you love go out for a walk get some sunshine and also don't forget to get proper sleep Step number three is just clean your space. I feel 
if your space is clutter free you mentally feel better so try and pick a pick a day of a week and try and declutter clean the whole house and personally for me cleaning is a stress buster even though i have a toddler i have to make sure my house is neat and clean for me just feel better and i think i read it somewhere that it is so important that your space is clutter free and neat for you to mentally feel better so try and do that um and see if you like it try and pick a day of a week maybe you know and try and clean either your cupboard your your kitchen pantry or your some kind of or your office area somewhere where it's clean and you're not just focusing on what's going on Step number four is take it slow. Just take a step back and just relax. What I have realized is you don't have to do every single thing what's mentioned in your to-do list. And that's okay if you don't do everything in one day. There's enough next thing you can try and prioritize and see what's important and try and concentrate more on that particular task rather than doing every single thing and just out so why don't we just concentrate on just one task and just take it slow take a deep breath relax and do it slow it'll help you Number five is breathe and meditate. All you need is just 10 minutes in your day and just close your eyes, try and concentrate on that breathing and just relax your mind. What I personally love doing is I try and put Om chanting music in the background that actually helps me a lot to just relax my mind and just, just concentrate on my breathing and I feel so good. Number six is gratitude. Now cultivate the habit of being grateful for every good thing that comes to you and be thankful for what you have. Now I'm someone who will never sit down and write what I'm grateful for but I've learned that if you do that it's actually really good for you. So I try my best to sit down and write what I'm grateful for in this life. Sometimes if time permits I do that. Step number seven is, if possible, try and be in nature. Feel the air, feel the sun and just breathe and oh my god, it makes so much of a difference. You feel so positive, so relaxed and so happy. So try and do that. So these were the seven steps what actually helped me a lot to feel better emotionally, physically and mentally and especially now the world is going crazy there's so much going on in the world so yeah I hope this can help you in some way or the other and yeah thank you so much for watching this video guys and I will see you guys soon in my next upload bye